Finally, a multiplayer mech game is out on PSVR. This is gonna be awesome. Let's let's go ahead and check out the trailer. Uh, okay, we're in the distant future. The world's low on resources. Only mechs can save it. Hey, what a great setup. I mean, you know, it's a little generic, but I, I'm still curious to see how that's gonna translate into the game, how it's gonna factor into the combat and the world. Oh, oh, it doesn't. It's just some generic apocalyptic text to get you excited for a game that's not even finished. Let's talk about Code 51 Mech Arena. I've been wanting a mech game on PSVR basically since the beginning. And this game looked promising. I like the more slow paced flow of gameplay. It gives the machines a real nice sense of weight to them while also being a bit more VR friendly. The game has unlockable suits that you get by leveling up which is great. Each mech has its own strengths and weaknesses, different abilities and weapons to use so they each feel unique. This is the first game that I'm aware of that completely replaces the right stick with your head for movement. And it actually feels pretty natural once you get used to it. The shooting feels great and honestly the controls in general feel really solid. The only problem is they forgot to make a full game around the controls. I almost don't even know where to start. There's no music. Not in the menus, not in the game. On top of that, I think some of the sound effects are missing. You're pretty much only hearing yourself. Every now and then you'll hear an opponent's gunfire or missile, but it sounds like you should be hearing more, and sometimes you don't hear anything at all. The sound design in this game is just awful. So what you get are these really barren feeling matches, it lacks any amount of energy or excitement. The game has a pretty basic tutorial mode, it also has a practice mode that pits you against AI and it's adequate enough for the kind of mode that it's trying to do. But then when you go online, barely anyone is playing and this is day one. The game just came out and there are only four player matches but I'm always finding at least one or two AI in the same game as me. It doesn't help that at the end of the match you're kicked back to the main menu. You cannot do this in a multiplayer VR game. You need to automatically put the players from the last match in another queue immediately so that people can group up and actually play against other people instead of just bots. The only playable mode outside of training and practice is deathmatch, that's it. And that gets old really quick. The maps aren't terrible. They are a little forgettable, but they're not terribly laid out or anything, they're, they're totally fine. But there's only three of them. And then when you go... Uh, you know what, I just realized I've had the VR blinders turned on for this whole video. Oh, jeez. That's embarrassing. Okay, let me, let me just go into the settings real quick and... I don't know if it was incompetence or if they just released this game with the intention of finishing it later. Either way, it's unacceptable. And now we have something that had a lot of promise, but it's still garbage in the end. Good controls, solid combat, can't save it when everything around it is either unfinished or just poorly executed. It's really hard for me to recommend this game to anyone. I, If you just have an insatiable need for a mech combat game in VR, this might scratch that itch a little bit. I say go play Starblood Arena instead. I'll see you guys next time.